talking shit at the palace. Niggas be broke and be starving, but still talking shit like they violent. Niggas, they say that they honest, some money these niggas gon' say that they got it. What's up? What's going on guys? Tyler here from Lifestyle Lifters. Got my boy Charles Lewis. Um, today we're gonna be talking about three tips on how to build muscle as fast and effectively as possible. Um, so number one, tip number one is gonna be progressive overload in the gym. Um, so on any of your compound movements, bench, squat, deadlift, overhead press, um, you can even consider a barbell row, you wanna be increasing each week um, either in rep or weight. Um, so you would be increasing by two and a half pounds, five pounds maybe at the most, or you can do uh, one or two reps. Um, so like this week, I hit 185 um, for four to six reps. Last week, I hit 180 um, for four sets of six reps. Um, the way I plan this out and uh, just going up um, is when I can hit um, for all sets, the top amount of reps that I'm supposed to. So example for this one, it's four sets of four to six reps. Um, so if I can hit six reps for all of them um, without anybody helping me, like on the bench having to help me, spot me, um, I'll move up the weight. And so um, I was able to hit, uh, when I moved up this week, I hit six reps for the first two sets, and then I dropped to four uh, reps in the third set. So I'm about to try the fourth set. Um, I should be able to hit four, maybe crank out five. Um, but that means for next week, I'm gonna stay at this weight until I can hit six consistently. Hop in a coupe, let go, yeah Turn on the radio, yeah Baby, just let me know, yeah I want to make the road, yeah I want to walk the green, yeah I want to perk the lane, yeah She want to top the team, yeah That is a thought to me, yeah I got a glot of beam Last week somebody commented in uh, one of your comments and said that's what she said What's your, uh, what's your response to that? You know, she says a lot of things, you know that's, I can't remember them all, you know <laughs> <laughs> Till we make it out of sticks You a broke nigga, probably switch up for a bitch I was in the game, you were sitting on the bench Chillin' with my woes like we came in front of six I don't fuck with girls that be all up in the mix Here he sending threats and I ain't even here to diss I know I know one cause I got these niggas pissed Make this shit look easy, I ain't have to make a wish Tip number two for you guys is form. Now, with this one specifically, it's a standing dumbbell press. Uh, this is what we do instead of an overhead press, we do that on our second push day. So on this one, um, what you could do is, uh, the reason I don't like to do it sitting is because when you're sitting, you have a lot of force coming through the legs. So you're using a lot more um, of your other body parts to move the weight. When you're standing, you're only using basically your shoulders because you don't have anything to drive your feet into the ground. Um, and also with this one, you can get the weight and you can do you can like this. But that's not the way you want to do it because that's not going to build muscle. That's not going to help you overload because then you're doing heavier weight than you should be doing. You want to leave your ego at the door when you come into the gym, guys, so that you can build muscle. Because um, if you're just lifting too heavy a weight and it's not what you should be doing, you're just wasting your time. I'm using bad form. So with this one, you're doing 10 to 12 reps, four sets. I'll show you how to get some good food. Hey, I ain't worried about this bitch. Boy, you better get some money for you end up in a ditch. Hop in a coupe, let go, yeah. Turn on the radio, yeah. Baby, just let me know, yeah. I want to make the road, yeah. I want to walk the green, yeah. I want to perk the lane, yeah. She want to top the team, yeah. That is a thought to me, yeah. I got a glot of beam. I live the life you dream. I had to do it myself. Cause these niggas not for me. So, as you can see, on the 11th and 12th reps, or struggling there, and that's what you want to be doing. You want to hit the 10th rep, and then after that, um, you want to be able to hit the other two reps, but it's not very, it's not key. Um, if you can hit them, great. You want to try and hit them for all four sets and then move up weight. But if you can't, then you just want to make sure that the form is good all the way throughout. And so like that one, I had the back straight, shoulders back, and I was pressing up, and not using half reps, um, not stopping right here before I get down low. You want to come all the way down to get the full stretch in the shoulder, to make sure you're hitting the overall shoulder and get those shoulder gains. Form, guys, it's the wave. All right, so uh, this is a little extra tip for you guys. If you're looking to get some dope gym gear, then you gotta check out Alpha Elite. Got the new camo joggers on, looking sick. And then we also got Junk Brands headbands on. I'm gonna link those down in the description. Check them out, guys. I mean, uh, he's wearing Gymshark. 
But uh, don't check out Gymshark. Only out for Even with their 50% off sale? Well, that's just, um, yeah. that's, uh, that's cause it's just not as, not as quality. What do you mean? It feels pretty nice. I'm, I'm just saying. It feels mm -hmm. pretty nice to me. What? It feels pretty nice. Are you supposed to be working out right now? Me? Yeah. You're right, bro. <laughs> See? See, that's how I feel it, guys. We know what we're doing. I try not to go too far up <laughs> because I want to try to keep the tension and, and still flex out my tricep. Because right here, I'm, I'm flexing out my tricep, but over here, it's kind of like relaxing, you know what I mean? So I try to go maybe not any more than like 90 degrees, you know? So I try to be here and at the bottom, or I'll throw out the whole, the whole, um, what is it, rep? I want to try to like curve my, my wrist. Not like this. Look at the, look at the you know what I mean? I want to curve it so that at the end I can squeeze a little bit more in, in my forearms and it'll squeeze up in my tricep. Green, yeah. I want to perk the lane, yeah. She want to top the team, yeah. That is a thought to me, yeah. I got a glot of beam. I live the life you dream. I had to do it myself. Cut these nigga not for me. These bitches make believe. Playing games like hide and seek. I'ma keep being myself. Cause that's how it's to be. Click. Grind with my brothers till we make it out of sticks. How did that feel, man? Ah, uh, she was hard. I can only do 12 reps, and it's 12 to 15 reps game, so. You went up in weight this week? Uh, yeah, 25. We had 20 last week, going up 25. Let's start progressive, bro. We'll scheme right there, play us. Right, Live by it. Cause I got these niggas pissed. Make this shit look easy, I ain't had to make a wish. All right, so if you will take any of these tips and put it to use, it's gotta be your diet, guys. Diet is going to be the key factor in building muscle and getting stronger in the gym each week. The way I do it is by tracking my macros each week. Um, so I set myself a calorie goal. Right now I'm in a surplus, so I'm at 3,900 calories, right? I weigh myself every morning, and I'm not looking to gain weight every day, and I know my weight's gonna fluctuate day to day, and I keep a track in uh, my notes log on my iPhone. Um, so you're not looking to gain weight every day if you're bulking. You want to gain about one to two pounds a month. And obviously, like I said, your weight's going to fluctuate. So if you drop a pound one day and then you gain two pounds the next day, it, that doesn't mean you gain two pounds of muscle mass or fat. Um, that just means that you know, you're waking up at a different time you have more food in your system from the other night. Um, but nevertheless, track your macros and you also want to be weighing yourself every day. And diet is gonna be key. Now, I'm not saying that you have to eat, you know, strictly, you know, potatoes, chicken, broccoli, rice. Although that is healthy, um, you you want to just be able to get the calories in. And I know that a lot of people won't advise us, you know, eating whatever you want. And I'm not telling you to eat whatever you want. You obviously want to get your fruit and your vegetables in. It's gonna help you with your micronutrients. That's good for the health. But in gaining weight and uh, putting on muscle mass and size, um, just tracking your macros and um, make sure you're weighing yourself every day and getting the calories in and staying consistent with your diet is gonna be uh, the biggest key. Because if, if you're inconsistent with it, you know, a couple days in a row you're at the surplus goal and then you're not tracking the next few days and you're lower on your proteins, lower on your fats, lower on your carbs, then it's not gonna work out for you in the end. You're gonna, you're gonna be staying at the same weight and you're gonna be asking, why am I not getting weight? Why am I not getting weight? Well, that's why you're not getting weight. Now I'm gonna turn over to Lyndon for some Cutting tips for what? With your diet. You gotta <laughs> tell me the diet, bro. You, you down? How, how many pounds you down right now, bro? What? How many pounds you down right now? I'm still at 20. 20 pounds down. Yeah. All right. So tell them how you've been losing weight with the diet, bro. I mean, low key. I've been, I've just been like. What do you mean low key? <laughs> low key? What? How okay. is it low key? It's not low key. I just don't track macros like the what? carbs, I have, I have uh, protein, and fats like religiously. I just do calories in versus calories out. I do a lot of cardio throughout the week. I would say. 300 bro 300 every night and the the most I would do a night was probably like 600 but uh, that's what that, that's only if time prevails but um honestly for me I find it easier for like easier and less stress to just do calories in versus calories out I mean obviously if you want to be in competition and really get your abs showing like really quick you go macros you know what I mean your carbs fats and proteins you'll track that but honestly I'll, I'll keep going my calories in calories out until I like stop wow. hitting um, <laughs> so I stopped hitting the, you know, stop losing weight, and then I'll go tracking my macros to get that little bit extra more. So that's, it's been working for me, for me so far. Yeah, that's the starting. That's that used to be me.
Damn, where's his hair at? What? You got him now. What is that picture? Huh? What is that picture? Yo, chill, man. <laughs> Bro, you yeah. saved me that for the, the transformation pit. Yeah. All right, so now for the post-workout meal, we in bulking season right now. So we're going to Tenders UCF. And tater tots. I know I'm on the diet, but... Refeed day, refeed day. This week, yeah, I haven't eaten carbs in so long. Have you even eaten anything today? Huh? Have you eaten anything today? I low-key just stayed in bed all day and waited for you guys. <laughs> really? I haven't eaten. Mm. A flame. Quick shout out to the uh, clothing <gasps> brand. I got an extra, I got a fry. Hey, I'm trying to give a shout out. Bro. Oh. Shout out to Alphalete. Alphalete, hold on. Back, hold on. Back, hold on. Back, Alphalete, Alphalete. Alphalete. You, uh, if you want to check it out, where's the, where's the uh, link to the website going to be, Charles? You know what? No, no, no. It's going to be up here now. Can you put the link up there? I can't link in the fucking video. All right, restart, restart. All right. All right, so as you can see, I absolutely destroyed that meal. And... No, oh, oh, what's going on, Charles? I'm taking my time. Oh, you're taking your time. All right, we'll just keep the camera here, bro. We'll watch you with the rest of the movie. All right. I'm like you, I actually had like 300. No. <laughs> 300 calories? You and JJ, bro. 300 calories a day. <laughs> but nothing in the gym. <laughs> Solid 10 out of 10, guys. Yeah, that's pretty good. For a good price. What the fuck are you doing? Is he Tyler? <laughs> this, is, <laughs> this is why he's not a cons constant of Can you finish guys. your food? What are you, five years old? <laughs> Playing with your food. Damn. <laughs> With my brothers till we make it out of sticks You a broke nigga, probably switch up for a bit